Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got this irregular pentagon A, B, C, D, P such that this angle A is 45 degrees, this angle B is 80 degrees, this angle C is 90 degrees, and this angle D is 75 degrees. And now we are going to calculate the angle X Please don't forget to give a thumbs up to this video. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first step. Let's talk about the sum of the interior angles of this polygon. And here's the sum of the interior angles formula. Total interior angles equal to 180 degrees times n minus 2 where n is the total number of sides and since we are dealing with the pentagon so our n values is going to be equal to 5 so therefore sum of interior angles is going to be equal to 180 degrees n in our case is 5 minus 2 and that is going to give us 540 degrees and here's our next step the sum of the interior angles we are going to take the sum of angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d and then plus angle p so we have our angle a is 45 degrees plus angle b is 80 degrees plus angle c is 90 degrees plus angle D is 75 degrees and we don't know angle P just leave it like this one that's going to be equal to 290 degrees plus angle P but we know our sum of interior angles is 540 degrees so I'm going to write equal to 500 and 40 degrees let's solve for angle p now let's go ahead and subtract 290 degrees from both sides they cancel each other out so our angle p turns out to be 250 degrees and here's our final step let's go ahead and calculate the angle x and here's the very first thing we are going to do we know that the whole this angle is 360 degrees this is equal to the sum of these two individual angles x and this angle p so therefore i can write this angle x plus angle p equal to 360 degrees but we know our angle P is 250 degrees. So I can write, I can replace this angle P by 250 degrees equal to 360 degrees. Now let's go ahead and uh, subtract 250 degrees from both sides. So this is gone. So our angle X turns out to be simply 110 degrees degrees so thus our angle x turns out to be a 110 degrees thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye